So guys, stay tuned to learn how to make Bratz hats. What you guys will need is some scissors, a glue stick, a hot glue gun, some card cuttable, cuttable cardboard. This is just from a shoe box top and it works perfectly fine. It depends if you have the good scissors. And two kind of cloths. Um, these are just two shirts that I don't wear anymore. And let's get started. Okay guys, what you need is the cardboard, um, a pencil too. So you might want to grab a big cup. This is an Annapolis Navy cup. Um, hold on, let me fix my camera. Okay. And it's a pretty big one. You're going to want to make a hole. So draw out a hole. I mean, draw out a hole. I'm just going to use this side because I, I am planning to make another hat. So you don't want to use all your cardboard. Like, don't do it right in the center. Or it's cuttable. The circle doesn't even have to be perfect. So you have that step done, and what you're going to do, you're going to cut it out. But before you cut it out, um, okay guys, you just need a regular toilet paper roll that is done. Um, here's one I have. As you can see, I cut it to make this hat. And I had another one to make this hat. This was the first hat I made. It's not, it's kind of old now, but it was, it was a good hat. Okay, so you might want to cut the size that you want. As in, I don't have that much of toilet paper. I'm not going to get a pretty big size. I'm just going to cut it and leave this over here in my little box. So this is the side you want. Now it's going to look like this, so you might want to pat it back out to its circular shape. Now put it in the middle wherever you want this hat part to be. Okay, um, so I want mine to be about there. Instead of going around it, we're going to go in it. So, hold on. Let me find the right part where I want it. Then you sort of circle it. It's not the best circle in the world. But it doesn't matter. It's not going to be perfectly circled. So I'm going to cut this out, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so you want to cut out the big circle first, um, so I'm just going to cut this out. Okay guys, um, so I cut out my circle, so this is what we have so far. This is just the back of the tissue, I mean shoe box. It's not a perfect circle as you can see, but if you want, you can fix the edges or leave them alone. I'm just going to fix them real quick. Just chop off the pointy parts. Make it look nicer. So that's what you have so far. Um, and you also have this. You don't have to do anything. So for this center hole, what you want to do, and you might need a parent you might want a parent to do it. I'm 13 personally. Um, I think I can do it all 13 year olds or older. If you think you can do it, but I would suggest a guardian to do this part. You're just going to get the scissor and sort of push it out. Did I do it this way? Yeah. So right there you have a hole in there. And uh, as you can see, there's a hole in this hat, there's a hole in this hat, because I thought that my doll's head would fit in there, but uh, brats have mighty big heads. They tend to. So what we're going to do, we're going to try to cut the circle out. It's not going to be a perfect circle, but we're going to try, I, I personally am going to try my best. Oh, and you don't want to cut bigger than the circle, but that is approximately how big
Okay, so you have the circle out. It's not perfect, but I sort of tried my best. Um, I'm sorry if this like circle bothers you. It bothers me a little too. Um, it's not even a circle. We should call this shape the flarg shape. I don't know. I'm sorry. Okay, so you have that down. Now, you what you need. This is a part that I want. Literally, I want a parent or guardian to do for any kind of age. I did it myself because I found out how to make the hats. And it's not that my parents wouldn't take the time. It's just I experienced this myself. But I did get burned because I used hot glue. You can't see it, but I got burned in my thumb. So you do need a parent or guardian. Um, I do not know if Elmer's glue works. Um, super glue does not burn but it sticks to your fingers horribly. I know because I've put on fake nails before. Um, I'm not, I mean, it, and it makes, I don't know, just I use hot glue personally. So you might need your two cloths that you want. Okay, I'm using the strangest kind of cloth material polka dots with this uh, yellow shirt. Um, okay. So this is what we're going to use, the polka dot, as in I don't have a lot of it left. I'm going to use it for this part right here, as in you can tell this is gray. And this is why it's not completely red or completely spider-like. So this is for the hat thingy part. But this is going to go around the whole hat. So what you want to do is, with whatever shirt that you do not wear or whatever cloth you have, I don't buy like cloth and stuff, I just use my that I don't use. Actually, this, this it's not that this is small on me, it's just, it's really loose. I don't know, I don't like it. So, I don't really care for it. You don't even have to make like a perfect, it's not even going to matter. Just something to cut it out. You have your part right there. So, uh, you might need, you might want to get started on your hot glue. As you can tell, I just used mine, so I'm going to clean it out with my scissors. You guys don't even need to see this. Oh, that is not good. Okay, I'm gonna plug it in. Okay guys, I'm sorry. My camera keeps falling, it's making me mad. So you have your cloth. It does not matter which part you want it, this way or this way. I'm gonna use it this way, just cause I can. Okay. You're gonna place it over your cloth. Okay, then you're gonna flip it over. And this is where it gets a little hard. So remember, have a parent... I'm so sorry about my nails. <laughs> They're really bad. Have a parent or guardian help you with this. Or s a, an adult. Yes, an adult. Someone that can handle hot glue. Because I know a lot of Bratz viewers are around, um, like, s not six, but eight to nine or seven or something like that. I'm not sure. Even though you're supposed to be 13 for YouTube accounts, but it's okay to see it. But put it there, and then you're going to fold your cloth. Now be careful, because the glue is hot, but you're going to fold your cloth. So this part right here is hot glue. Now see where it bends? So it bends right there. I'm going to put some hot glue on the cloth. Not a lot, just a little dab. Just so you guys know, this is going to get messy. So, uh, my thumb still hurts because it like, burned myself with the hot glue. Like, I was trying to push it down and I like burned myself and it was on my thumb. And I'm like, it took me a second. I'm like, ah, it hurts. So, that's huh. five stars for being a loser and burning myself. Yeah.